All right, hi guys. So I'm gonna show you guys a recipe for um, some sugar glider food that uh, I got from the lady that I got a couple of my sugar gliders from. Hold on one sec, I gotta get the juice out of the fridge. And vitamins. All right. So it's basically similar to the APW diet that I ordered from um, what did I order this from again? Exotic Nutrition. That's it. So this comes in a jar. The downside is it's a very small jar. I have a lot of sugar gliders, so I got it just for something different for them. And then I also have this for them, gummy vor mix um, that I give them too. I give them a lot of different things. So the ingredients for it is baby apple juice. Um, that's a quarter of a cup of baby apple juice, a half a cup of honey, has to be not, it says not raw or unfiltered, it has to be 100% honey, it says on there. We got hard boiled egg, two, I you do two, I, and then I cut them up in little tiny pieces. Um, a fourth a cup of yo baby yogurt, which comes in these little cups, so I use one of those. Um, it mixed fruit juice, which I just bought grape juice this time for them. And I'm probably going to use that for the apple in that because juice, because I'm, or I might put some applesauce if I have some baby applesauce in there since I'm almost out of apple juice. You can kind of add some different things, a few different things if you want to. And then we have two different cal we have calcium. This is actually for reptiles, but she. I guess with the recipes you can use it, which I also have the um, complete vitamin mix for them, which I put some of that in there too. But for the Repta Calcium, you put in, let's see, which one is it? Pink labels is two teaspoons, and this is the multivitamins, and this is one teaspoon. Um, two jars of meat, ba chicken meat baby food. A fourth of a cup of wheat germ and a half a cup of dried baby cereal. You can do mixed or oatmeal. This one was whole wheat. This is the one she sent with them. And then I just bought this one. This one's oatmeal. So I take in and um, you could probably use like a blender or um, a smoothie machine something like that if you want I just cut up the, that the egg real fine and then I just use this whisk and then I'll whisk everything together and then I put it into two it, it's enough to fill two ice cube trays and then each sugar ladder is supposed to have a half an ice cube at night what I do is I cut them in half. I have five gliders. I have three in one cage, so they get one and a half, and then the other ones get one. And then it melts down. I put them out about an hour before they're ready to eat. And then I also usually give them some type of baby food, a little bit of baby food in their um, food thing. I give them some mealworms sometimes, or sometimes I do a veggie. And then um, they have their hard food. They also get fresh fruits and veggies. Um, and then uh, different treats that I've purchased um, from Exotic Nutrition, and that's what they have every day. So I change it up all the time. With this, they get every night, but I change up the fruits and veggies every day so they have something different. So hopefully this will be helpful if anybody's interested. I'll just show you the recipe. Right quick here. She wrote down. You can read her hand, the handwriting. For anybody that's looking for something that's simple, if you're busy, you work a lot, it's nice because you can just do this in the evening, pull them out an hour before or so before your gliders wake up, put it in there. Next morning, just take it all those, what's left out. Usually there's none left. They usually eat it all. Um, I don't know. I think a half cup's little, but then if you think how small sugar glider is, that's not that bad. Plus, you want them to eat their fresh fruits and veggies and everything, too. So, all right, guys. Well, that's it for now. I'm going to let you go because i got to make this stuff up and get it in these containers for them for tonight. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Please subscribe and hit the like button.